Yo, what's going on everyone? Today I got another tier list video for y'all. I did a little poll a while back um, asking you guys about what you guys wanted to see in terms of tier list. It seems like you guys liked my last video rating all the Genji skins on a tier list. But if you haven't checked that already, go ahead and check it out. Um, but today I got another video with tier list. Um, it's not just Genji, it's going to be rating all of them. Um, but not on how good they are, but how fun they are. If you enjoyed this video, uh, please leave a like and sub and comment down below if you disagree or agree with anything. Um, and without further ado, let's get straight into it. Um, so first, we're going to start off with Ana. Honestly, Ana, I think... I personally think Ana is a pretty fun hero. Um, it's not absolutely S tier, like I'm dying to play her though. Um, she does a, quite a bit of damage, especially with her recent buffs. I think she's quite fun. Um, also, you can just show off that, hey, I got hella damage. What are y'all doing? You know, type shit. And I think she's just the most engaging healer. Honestly, it's at a, at a comfortable A just to start it off. Ash. In terms of fun, I, I'm kind of, uh, I'll put her at a, I'll put her at a, uh, maybe a C. Now, she's a very simple hero. Um, she has a coach gun that she can get to high ground with or push people back. I think the most fun thing is shooting the dynamite and doing like hella burst damage. Honestly fun to hear all those ticks going off, but uh, she's a very laid back character. Um, you can really just stay back, shoot, whatever. Um, it's fun calling Bob though. Um, and just seeing, seeing your boy go off, but you know, it is what it is. You can disagree with me all you want. Um, uh, Bap, I think Bap is, I'm gonna put Bap with, I'm gonna put Bap with Ana. I think Bap is also a fun one, because you're basically like soldier, but with like a, kind of like a burst rifle. His immortality is, uh, it's really cool to see, uh, you save someone. You can really solo carry with Bap, honestly. Um, and I mean, who doesn't like to feel like, hey, I'm a support hero, by the way, type shit. I think he's pretty engaging, uh, especially if you're a much higher level Bap um, and just trying to try to max out the APM on Bap. Um, just like shoot, shoot, heal, shoot, shoot, heal, whatever. Bastion, I'm going to be. I think Bastion is quite fun, um, especially when you go into that turret form. Um, but other than that, a lot of his... Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I'm going to put Ash at B. I'm, I'm kind of thinking a little bit more. Uh, Bastion at C. Don't get me wrong, Bastion's fun. But the main part of his kit that like hard carries is that turret form. His alt sucks. Like, really, really sucks. Um, the grenade, I don't really know why that's like there. Um, I think they should make it to where he can heal himself again, personally. Other than that, I think he's like fine. Um, he's just kind of a, he's kind of boring, I guess, cause you're just playing for his turret form. That's like the most fun I find on him. Brig, um, I'm gonna say C again. Um, Brig is uh, something. Actually, I'm gonna put her at D. And I say that just because um, her kit is very simple. Um, but I guess they took away your shield bash, which is a hallelujah, but, um, but you're kind of just, what, pressing mouse one, throwing armor packs, and, and yeah, her, her kit's so simple, um, I feel like my grandma could probably play Brig and, you know, get some value out of her. Obviously, right now, she's not in the best spot, um, I had to deal with her in goats, so, I, I don't know, death to Briggs. Cassidy, um, C, as well. I would see. Once again, his kit is very, very, very simple. Literally, if you play CSGO, you play this dude. Um, especially if you use a deagle type shit. Or Sheriff from Valorant. I mean, you just click heads. Um, you have a bullshit sticky grenade. Um, so what, all you have to do is just hit someone once, literally, and then they'll die. Yeah. I mean, it's high noon. You just look at people. You see a skull, they die. Yeah, not, you can't really go in depth with uh cassidy so yeah doomfist high key in s tier um i just think i personally am not that good with doom but when i do play him i have this dope skin um and i just you know slam block punch um i mean he's a very unique character um, i don't really think there's a, another fps game that has a punching type character that does like combos and shit 
I don't know if I'm like a Overwatch 1 coper. I do kind of miss uh, DPS Doom. Um, that uppercut slam and actually doing some damage was quite fun. And just watching people splat on the... Um, I guess they needed more tanks in Overwatch 2. Um, I think Doom is quite fun. Um, we got one week of fun. And now he's back to being kind of a Z tier pick. But uh, D.Va I think is a B. Um, just because personally I don't like playing against D.Va. I don't know. You just kind of... You boost. You rocket. You eat shit. And you kill people. And then you can turn your mech into a nuclear bomb and try to blow people up not really much um but yeah that's something echo i think echo is a fun fun fucking hero i think the funnest thing to echo is uh when that one dude is uh when you're bullying this one dude and he's about to kill you and then you duplicate into him and then you kill him with his own character i think that's fun as shit also who doesn't like flying around everywhere and being an annoying like wasp i don't know you stick someone laser beam fly out that that's fun as fuck yeah i mean her ultimate is cool genji uh i think y'all know where it is going um you know hey who doesn't like to be, you know, I like feeling like I'm Japanese and running around, dashing, deflecting, and swinging, saying, I think all of the subscribers on my channel, um, if you haven't already, you should subscribe, uh, would, would probably feel the same about Genji. So, really no explanation. Hanzo! Um, I think Hanzo might be another B tier uh, for me, um, but I'll just put him right there. And I think Hanzo is fun. Uh, I feel cool popping those storm arrows and once again, you know, summoning two gigantic dragons and saying more Japanese things and shooting it is quite fun. Uh, but, uh, once again, his kit's kind of, uh, I guess his kit's kind of a little more complex than, say, Cassidy. Um, yeah, the storm arrows are fun. Uh, jumping, wall climbing, and all that. Uh, actually, I'll put, how about, uh, eh, it kind of feels weird. Anzo above or below Ana. Junker Queen. Um, I don't have too much experience on Junker Queen, but when I do play her, she is quite fun. Uh, but for now, I'm just gonna put out a B. Her shout is cool. All is something. It's definitely powerful, but you know, Kiriko exists, so whatever. Uh yeah, I'll just leave her at a B. Junkrat. I'll put him an A. Um, I mean his kit is kind of uh simple. You know, there's a trap. See people trap, you blow them up. And you have two concussions mines. I think is quite fun. Junkrat's kind of like a, like a meme to me. So I, I enjoy playing him. And just, you know, when I want to relax and just sit back and blow people up. Kiriko. I don't have too much experience on Kiriko as well. I'm just going to put her at B. Um, I guess it is cool, you know. Also with the BAP thing, you know, saving people. You can also wall climb and your alt. Um, your alt's quite cool. Um, doing like the fox shit. And then shooting people at two times the speed and getting all your cooldowns back faster. Uh, I feel like for me personally, I enjoy playing Ana, Bap, um, and a couple other healers and Kiriko. Um, but hey, if you like Kiriko, you know, good for you, good for you. Lucio, Lucio, oh, oh yup, yup. I, for me, I think Lucio is like the healer of Genji's. You know, you just jump everywhere, wall ride heal yourself and speed boost who doesn't like wall riding um and booping everyone just being an annoying little mole i i just enjoy moving fast and harassing people in their back line and then my team's asking hey where's our lucio and what is he doing type shit may i think may is a c tier maybe d Pretty close. I mean, you can just freeze people, put a wall up, and I guess heal yourself. She just doesn't seem like the most interesting character to me. Eh, I don't know, she's so simple. You know, you shoot people, they kind of get slowed now and stuff and frozen. Her ult is kind of sleeper. She is okay. Um, and I don't really feel like there's anybody in the world that is just like, I want to play Mei. You're sick if you do. Mercy, I think, is... I might anger all the Mercy players in the comments, um, hate me, but I think she is the most boring healer to play. Um, you literally mouse one or 
left or right click um to heal or damage boost your little e-boy or e-girl um trying to play genji or some other dps um you press two other buttons like shift and spacebar and crouch you fly like a freaking f-22 raptor jet trying not to get shot out of the sky and i guess some i feel like you're a masochist if you like playing mercy because you know you're just getting shot out of the sky sometimes and you're like and you might feel excited trying to get shot out of the sky i don't know about you but that's kind of weird um moira um as much as i hate moira players when i do players like the most free thing um just chucking an orb and doing a kamehameha i hate moiras on my team she is something and i think a lot of people don't like her i am no different um her kit's pretty simple you got a damage orb and a healing orb and you kamehameha and you have a fade um the fade is uh i guess you can do some cool movement shit with it she's just not that interesting to me though orisa i think is um eh, i'll put her i'll put her with diva um you can definitely make some cool plays with her and then i bet you've all seen the tiktok clips of orisa's jumping off suiciding off the map just so she can suck everyone but once again she's not that interesting to me um she obviously has a hard time dying um you have a javelin spin and a spear she can chuck but yeah i mean she can she definitely has a bit of a more in-depth kit than let's say like cassidy but shit uh there isn't really too much to ponder over when it comes to orissa for me Farah, um i'll like put her at a c um i do enjoy playing farah but i won't lie um she literally has two abilities um being her jump jet which is so she can fly up and then her concussive blast to uh you know move people around get some cool hits on her um the main thing her barrage um uh, always gets me killed but i do end up getting some kills here and there it is quite fun who doesn't like flying ramatra i think is high key in s tier in terms of fun his his design is so cool and his voice lines um his abilities it's like a shield and turning into nemesis form and just punching the shit out of everyone is fun as fuck and then his alt is probably the thing that carries him the most that alt is freaking crazy i love this character um i might try to learn him a little bit reaper reaper uh i don't know reaper at a, a c i mean obviously he's fun to play um and you pumping everyone with shotguns and pressing one button to kill like the whole team around you um but yeah i mean there's, there's really not much to it um he just kind of you know you win he has a get out of jail free card with his shift um and then he's tp um you know it's quite useful ryan i think ryan is a a tier pick um absolute chad man of a pick um who doesn't like swinging their hammer and earth shattering and saying ryan diff when you block the enemy shatter getting getting a whole man shatter with with his ultimate is quite fun um and just swinging and fire striking everywhere and i think i i respect ryan mains heavily Rodog. i think Rodog's a b Road dog for me. Um, I mean, there's really two things to his kit: a hook and a vape. His hook is quite fun, uh, landing that thing and one-shotting people, or just moving them around places. Um, I mean, it's kind of free because you can get it so often. You can just blast people with the thing, hook them in. It's not too in depth compared to the other heroes. Sigma is, I think, a high A tier, low key. So our favorite schizo, Sigma. I just wish, you know, he had some. I don't know if you can tell a trend, but I do like uh, crazy mobility. Unless it's, I guess, Ramatra is a, like one exception. I like chucking balls and rocks. He chucks uh, balls and a shield. Um, and I think his ultimate is quite, quite amazing. Um, quite fun. Sojourn, um, as much as I hate this piece of shit hero um that is killing the game low-key uh put her at a put her an a obviously 
she is probably still the strongest hero as of this video um just and they buffed freaking railgun while alting or overclock um but besides that um i mean she can slide uh yeah um uh, cool mobility um and she does quite a bit of damn damage soldier i think soldier is a soldier for me is a s tier low key um i enjoy sprinting and you know out movementing people i think it's funny to watch i think it's funny to watch you sprint around everywhere and people can't hit you um and you have a healing your own healing station so you don't have to rely on your healers so you can kind of go a little bit more freely um as well as the helix rockets are a nice touch um and as ultimate is aimbot so eventually in the match you can just sit back and shoot people for free sombra i think is sombra for me personally is a d tier um now actually she might be a little bit above i don't know i just feel like i'm kind of a a wuss um uh, just hacking people while in viz and then shooting them when they can't really do much to you and then, you know if you get low you just tp back hack a health pack do the same hold process until you get an emp i don't really enjoy doing that personally if you do you know fuck you um this is just my opinion by the way um symmetra honestly i think she's quite fun um she has a tp and some turrets and you just sit around and then you blast people with your laser beam yeah i don't really know much to say about her she has an ultimate as a as a whole like uh freaking shield wall across the map torb 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 i think torb is a fun motherfucker honestly i just find the fun in the meme aspect um and just trying to hammer people and then when you find another torb on the enemy team you can just you know do your little hammer duels it's fun to shoot cheetos out of his his uh, cheeto gun um and then you know the good old coom launcher uh, just launching coom everywhere and they can't walk on that yeah a bit of survivability too with uh the overload i just think he's a funny hero um tracer i think is high key a really really fun hero i enjoy playing tracer while i'm playing her tracer's fun uh I like zipping everywhere and you know annoying the shit out of everyone widowmaker i think is a i'll say a c tier pick i personally think it's kind of boring you know sitting back in the map and you know sniping people i know a lot of people enjoy sniping i am not one of them i will say the one redeeming factor is it's quite satisfying just hearing those like headshots on widowmaker it's something Winton. I enjoy Winton a lot. I think he is fun. I like jumping everywhere and turning into a monkey. I also don't have to worry about aiming as much. Um, uh, I like punching people. I like Winton. Um, Ball. I don't really have much to say about him because I don't really play him. I do like his design. I think he's funny looking. I, I wish I was good at Ball, but uh, I'm not. So I can't really say much. Zarya. Um, I think Zarya's. Uh, I think Zarya's at a an a i'm gonna put that on ryan it's really fun to beam people um and you know save people with your bubbles and hear all of that uh, i just think it's quite quite satisfying uh hear all that and then you see everyone melt to your laser beam not really much um her grab is really fun you can just solo grab people and watch them type in chat bro why you solo grab me zen i enjoy playing zen a lot um but uh, i'm gonna put him on an a Maybe with like Torb, um, just because um, he does quite a bit of damage. Um, I think as a DPS player, he's quite fun to play with Discords and uh, the Transcendence builds quite fast. Um, looking at this list, uh, I might move May to D tier. Uh, I, don't, I don't really enjoy playing her. Um, and then maybe Orisa at C. And then so, eh, Sojourn can stay. Uh, I might put maybe junk right up b um looking at this list i'm personally satisfied with uh in terms of the fun factor i know this is quite a bit of a a long video but hey let me know down below if you enjoyed the video um if you did remember to hit the like sub and comment down below um, if you disagree or agree with anything i said also, I made a Discord recently, so if you guys want to talk and chat about Overwatch or any other things, link will be in the description if you guys want to join. Um, I hope to see you there. I'm still working some things out, uh, so give me suggestions if I want to add anything in the Discord. All my other socials are down there as well. 
hopefully i'll see you in the next video take care of yourself take care of each other peace and love baby